Hey guys, happy new year. So this video is going to be kind of a clean with me and a cook with me too. I really need to clean my kitchen. It's just a mess. It's a mess. I also kind of want to clean out my refrigerator because I haven't done that in so long. And I know there's tons of stuff in there that I need to throw out and like I have to go through all the condiments and stuff like that. So I figured I would just go ahead and vlog today and then I'm going to go ahead and cook a Kung Pao chicken like crock pot recipe. Um, my mom actually sent it to me a couple weeks ago and the recipe just looked so amazing. I love Asian food, so does Alex. So I figured doing a crock pot like Kung Pao chicken would just be so yummy. So I went and picked up all the ingredients from the store yesterday, but there was a couple things that I wasn't able to get at like my local grocery store. So I'm gonna have to run to another one and pick the last few items up. Uh, and then we can go ahead and get started. But I did want to share with you some products that I just recently got from Grove Collaborative. Grove Collaborative um, is an online company that sells cleaning products and they're all like non-toxic, really nice products. And I always get my cleaning supplies from them. So they actually just sent me a whole package of stuff um, that I wanted to share with you guys because if you guys sign up with them, you can get all of this stuff for free. I love the smell of lavender so I figured I'd go ahead and start the new year with a lavender scent. But yeah, if you guys want to get your own um, free cleaning products then just sign up. I'll leave the link down below for new customers and if you're already an existing customer you can still get a free set of walnut scrubber sponges which are my favorite sponges. So let me just show you um, all of the products that you can get for free. You can get the dish soap and again they have so many different scents but I just went ahead and picked lavender because I love it. Um, and then you can get this hand soap. You can also get the hand lotion, which you guys know I have eczema, so I have to use lotion constantly. Um, here are the walnut scrubber sponges. Um, and then you also get this cool cleaning caddy to keep all your stuff in, so, so cute. So yeah, it's a great deal. I definitely think you guys should check out Grove Collaborative. Again, I will leave the links down below if you wanna go ahead and sign up and get some free goodies. Now that all that is said and done, we're just gonna go ahead and jump right into cleaning the kitchen and we're gonna start with the fridge. Cigarette ash It looks like snow cabinet that has like all our dry food in it <sighs> should I do it I'll show you guys like I haven't gone through here probably since we moved in like five years ago no joke there's just so much random stuff like all the way in the back that probably needs to be thrown out but I don't know if I should just like make that into another video because I still need to like scrub down the kitchen and start cooking and I don't want this video to be five hours long I'm like a sincerity But you don't care at all Miss Boo's lit cigarettes Trying to take me home Falling in love just a million times Breaking it off with the feeling on I sail She's cold as December cute you can put like soap underneath this with a little bit of water and then you just press down and the soap comes out and you can like scrub dishes or whatever with this I just love it I think that's so cute um, this is also another Grove product this is a glass cleaner and it works so well and you can like switch out the um, like sponge head so that's also really nice and then I might get rid of this this is like a Bath and Body Works like soap dispenser that you don't have to touch I bought this when I was like cooking so much raw chicken every single night and like having to touch it and go touch other things um, and I had to wash my hands a lot in between and I didn't want to like pick up the soap bottle so I bought this 
I think the batteries have died because it's just not working anymore and I haven't used it in forever. I'm tempted to like toss it, <laughs> but then I'm like, uh, no, it was like expensive. I don't want to throw it out. I swear I see that I got from Grove and it smells so amazing. It's a soy candle and it's the vanilla and sandalwood. And I am out of my um, my coffee one from Bath and Body Works, so kind of depressed about that. But I've been lighting this one and it literally smells amazing. just got to Balducci's, which is where I'm going to run in and try to get um, some dried chili peppers and a couple other things that I need. And like right when I was leaving, Cam woke up. So I told Alex that he woke up. He only slept for maybe an hour, which isn't very long for him. Ugh, so I'm going to just try and run in here real quick and be fast. And then I'll have to start cooking and show you guys like how I make this crock pot with Cam awake. So it may be a little bit difficult because he's going to be running around screaming, singing, you know. But I know you guys love when he's in my vlogs anyway, so you guys probably want to see him, so it'll be fine. Okay, so this should be everything I need for the Kung Pao Chicken Crock Pot, minus the chicken, which is still in the fridge. Um, but just some peanuts, cornstarch, rice vinegar, low-sodium soy sauce, um, some oil. I'm going to use sesame oil, some hoisin sauce, ginger. Um, a red bell pepper. I picked up two small ones because I'm doing um, a little bit more chicken than the recipe calls for. Um, I have to mince some garlic and then here are the dried chili peppers that I've literally gone to two different stores to find. So hopefully these are the right ones. And some brown sugar. Camden, can you say hi? Hi. <laughs> Did you just wake up from your nap? You didn't sleep very long. No, no, no. Isn't this little kitchen so cute? The sun is kind of like shining on it, so you can't really see it that well, but it's like the tiniest little kitchen. My mom got it for Cam for Christmas, and he likes it except for the first thing he does after Mama cleans up is throw every single thing on the floor. I don't know why. He just has to throw everything on the floor. Cam, what are you doing? Do you have to make a mess every single time? <laughs> Do you have to make a mess every single time? Hmm? Yeah. Pepper. Um, salt. Um, pepper. Um, salt. Um, pepper. Um, salt. Um, pepper. Um, That's not how you eat the pepper. Look, you go like this. You go like this. Some pepper. Okay. Then we take this out and we go ch -ch 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 salt. Um. Yeah, pepper. Um. Salt. <laughs> you gonna get up on the couch and drink your milk and watch some bubble guppies? Bubble, bubble. bubble guppies? All right. So we don't really let Cam watch TV um, unless he's drinking his milk on the couch. That's the only time that we let him watch TV for like 10 minutes. Just because otherwise he'll just throw his milk on the floor and he really won't drink it. Right? Is that what we do, Cam? Yeah. Yeah? Whoa. Whoa, you're so strong. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jumping bean. You're going to be doing pull ups in no time. Did 
was cut up the chicken in one inch cubes and then I put two tablespoons of oil. I used the sesame oil um, and I heated it on medium high heat and then now I'm just browning the chicken and then I'm going to add it to the crock pot with the dried red chili peppers. Okay, so I just made a huge mess. I um, split and deseeded 10 chili peppers and then I threw them in the crock pot over the chicken. Okay, so right now I am just stirring this mixture up. Um, it's the water, soy sauce, vinegar, brown sugar, hoisin sauce, garlic, and ginger, and I just stir it up in a bowl until well combined. Um, again, I will put the link to this recipe down below, which has like the exact measurements. You just pour the mixture all over the chicken and the chili peppers. Cover it. The directions actually say on low for four hours, but I don't have that option, so I'm just going to go ahead and put it on low for eight hours and just stop it after four. No, Cam, no, Cam, don't do that, honey. Uh-uh, we got to let it cook. Okay, does Mommy have to push this back a little bit? Yeah, we got to let it cook, sweetie. Oh, my goodness, Cam. What are you doing? Oh, my God. You're hanging? You're hanging like a little monkey? Okay, well, let's lock this so that that door doesn't come down, honey. Okay, I guess not. Total boy mom life. I don't know if any little girls do this, but Cam is just a wild little monkey man. If you guys have girls and they hang from things and like do all the crazy stuff that he does, let me know. Maybe it's just toddler life, but I swear it's it's boys. Hey you guys, so it has been four hours, so I'm turning this off. Actually, I want to put it on warm. There. And I'm going to add this mixture of cornstarch and water. And that's just going to thicken the sauce. My lips have been so dry lately, and I can't find my chapstick anywhere. Also, if you have good chapstick recommendations, leave them down below because no chapstick that I'm using is working for my lips right now. Like, they're super dry, and I can't even find any, so I'm just, like, putting on this lip gloss. But it's helping a little bit. Like, this lip gloss is so moisturizing. It's the Dior, like, plumping one, but it's, like, pretty moisturizing. Go ahead and put like maybe a half cup. Oh, that might be too many. Maybe I should just put. Oh my god, you guys, how amazing does this look? Oh, it looks so good. I am really proud of myself. <laughs> that is bomb. That is some good. Hung pow chicken. Wow. Okay. I'm going to go because I want to go eat this. The recipe does call for you to use um, chicken thighs and not chicken breasts like I used. But Alex and I like white meat a lot more than dark meat. Um, but the recipe does call for you to use chicken thighs because I know that dark meat holds a lot of moisture. Like it holds moisture better than white meat. White meat tends to dry out more. Um, so you can just, you know, do whatever you like. Don't forget to check out the links below for Grove Collaborative. If you're a new customer, you can get that whole set that I showed you earlier in whatever scent you want for free. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!